Today, the testing site at the Orange County Convention Center was forced to close early after relaxing their testing requirements. It reached its 250 person limit and the shutdown and shut down the line before noon today. News 6's Crystal Moyer was there when the last few patients were tested and spoke to the officials about what made today so different. Yeah, well, officials here tell me that there were 100 cars lined up just before 8 a.m. this morning. Today was that first day that they were testing here at the Orange County Convention Center with no age limits. And a nurse tells me today was noticeably different. We got a lot of people, sicker people today. Um, people are very scared. They were waiting for this day for a while to be able to come and get tested to finally know if they are sick with COVID-19. Um, some people just rolled the window and started crying. So happy to be here and, and grateful. Sasha De Caesar is a nurse working here every day to screen people for COVID-19 testing. She says their teams take turns with breaks, drinks a lot of water and has cooling buses. She also says they have all the equipment they need. To be honest, we're grateful because they are taking great care of us here. I have so many friends. I am for, from Orange County, so uh, and I work at many hospitals in the area and friends of mine have come here to get tested because they don't have enough PPE to be protected. The National Guard is also assisting in this process. Specialist David Martinez has been working in the testing area and as a dad, Martinez says seeing children move through this site hits close to home. I seen a young kid, so I kind of did, you know, uh, told him that he was strong. You know, I can't really communicate close. Yeah. Boom, he did. He gave me the gesture back. Uh, and laughed and giggled in, in the car. So I felt, you know, I felt, you know, like I was, you know, making an impact. The team of nurses and soldiers with the National Guard say they are honored to help the community through this difficult time. We're just pushing through. Our community needs us, so we're here. That nurse, Sasha De Caesar, says she also mentioned that people are coming together. People were bringing in neighbors and friends to get tested. Just a reminder that stay at home order statewide will not affect this testing site. They will still be open every day starting at 9 a.m. to test those who show up. Live in Orlando, Crystal Moyer getting results, News 6.